I'm going to be talking about indoor circuit boards. All circuit boards are input output. If I give it the proper input, it should give me the proper output. Get familiar with the sequence of operation of any furnace or air handler that you're working on. As that steps through its sequence, it may fail. From that point on is where you're going to be troubleshooting. So we want to make sure we have the proper inputs. We're going to be checking for inputs, then we're going to be checking our outputs. Make sure that the furnace is doing what it's supposed to do when it's supposed to do it. Also verify that you have a proper neutral and a proper ground to all furnaces because they're very susceptible with variable speed motors and, and different voltage igniters. We have to have a good neutral and a good ground, especially for flame rectification. Check from hot, and when I say hot, I mean the door switch. Go from the door switch to neutral. Go from the door switch to ground and go from the door switch to 24 volt common to make sure that all of those readings are the same. If they're not, we're looking for a loose connection, corroded connection, something like that. 